Well, Mopac, a road we all know, helping us traverse this growing city, but sometimes slowing us down. The road's so famous it even has a social media presence. Evil Mopac, if you haven't heard about it. I spoke with the self-proclaimed pro-gridlock activist to find out how everything came to be and how he's enjoying the city's growth. And it is an origin story. I don't want to go too back into it. It's not like a like with radiation or something in, in a lab, but you know there was a there was a, a bad day on Mopac or a good day depending on your perspective. And uh, I said, hey, I'd like to share this joy with with everyone. I jumped on Twitter, and uh, you know it was like an instant hit. Six months later, <laughs> it took a while. So, what do you think about all the growth here in Austin? And Austin's for everyone, and 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 well, it's not it's not for everyone. But a lot of people move here, and I, I think that's a great thing. And I think, you know, the fact that roads and trains aren't nearly keeping up with that is just a benefit to me and my account. Tell me a little more about your account. So I think it's, it's healthy to have a good self-perception of, of ways that Austin is funny and, and ways that you can make fun of it, and I love to do that. But, but at my heart, man, I do love this place. And if I didn't love this place, I'm not sure what I would do because I'm affixed to the ground. And I don't really have too many options. Tell us about the podcast. How's it going? Yeah, the podcast, we had a lot of fun with it, and we had a lot of, you know, great guests on it, and a, a few wild whales out there. I'm still trying to get, like, Willie and some other folk, but but it, it really went great. Uh, was it, it, it's kind of like a, a toll lane, although it's free, that you build, and, and maybe there aren't quite as many drivers on it as you anticipated, because there's so many other lanes they could be using, but, but you know, people who have reached out to me and... and you know, have been real kind about it, and I think the quality of the the quality of the product is there. It's just a question of it's a it's a buzzy environment on social and on with podcasts, and it is it is always tough, even for an incredible talent like myself. Um, it's it's always still pretty pretty tough to to get a foothold. So it's it's a work in progress. But season one ended in 2023, and season two uh, is on tap. Well, it is a road saying that, so I, I will say on tap for some time in May of 2024, but you never look at me delays with that. For the most part, nice uh, highway there, evil Mopac. Yeah, but did you get the opposing view and talk to 35? That's the See, next interview. As a balanced journalist, we've got to talk to I, both. So. I know, I know. I'm sorry. Next interview, I-35. I-35, we're you. coming your way.